All right, so a lot of times when you women purchase a gun, you purchase the wrong gun. You purchase a gun that don't fit your hand. You purchase a gun that you can't rack back. You purchase a gun that you can't break down and clean. And I had one young lady that had went to a gun shop and even the gun shop owners, you know, a lot of times they just want to sell a gun. They don't try to fit you with the right gun. They just want to sell you a gun. But anyway, they had sold her a gun that she could not handle. She couldn't rack it back. Hell, I couldn't even break the gun down. So uh, I'm just going to show you. This is the uh, Glock. What is that? Glock what? 42. Glock 42. Good handgun for a woman. So she's going to... Uh, Clear this gun. She's gonna break it down real quick. Let's go. So she took the clip out. She uh, racked it back to make sure it wasn't uh, <clears throat> it wasn't around in the chamber. So now, if she wanted to, she can uh, clean her gun. She could clean her barrel. Because it's best to always keep your gun clean. Now she's going to put it back. Now, after we shot earlier today, we clean our gun right on site. Still greasy a little bit. All right, now it's back together. Clip back in. Now, take that clip out of that gun one more time. Rack that gun back. Just want to show you ladies how easy it is for her to rack this gun back. Now, before <clears throat> we started, she had never handled a gun in her life. Uh, and here she is, sufficient and efficient in handling her gun, breaking her gun. And you guys seen the video of her shooting a gun. So I just wanted to show this video of, uh, of uh, her being able to break her gun down. A lot of times people don't show the maintenance part and that part of gun handling so again it's all about purchasing the right gun all right thank you guys